you know, I, I look at the Merida experience not as a failure, but an opportunity to improve um, shareholder return. Um, you know, as I look at, you know, some of my previous, you know, I, I, I've been fortunate enough to be in some industries that have continued to grow. Now, you talk about failure, I, I can give you one. So, um, I'm the general manager of Southern Ohio, Northern Kentucky for Pepsi. And at the time we said, hey, look, we want to try and test a new two liter bottle. And it was called the Grip. And it was a great, great looking bottle. Um, but the um, stability of the bottle was somewhat challenging because it was a two piece bottle that was molded. And so anytime you put carbonation into a two piece bottle that's molded, if the carbonate, if there's too much carbonation, you may have some explosive events. And so we were rolling this um, two liter bottle out in Dayton, Ohio. And I remember sitting in my office and I get a phone call from a CVS manager. And he says, you need to get over here right now. You need to I say, you need to get over here right now. Your display is exploding. I said, exploding? He says, it's exploding. So, so I get in my car, I drive over to the CVS and Literally, they had had a two liter display with our new grip bottles. And unfortunately, this bottle, the display was, it was summertime. They had the display in the window. And as the carbonation and the stability of the bottle got impacted, it exploded and it exploded all over the, you know, the, 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 the card section, you know, the, the holiday cards, the happy birthday cards. So the whole section had Pepsi all over it. <laughs> so, um, I don't know if that I, it, it was unfortunately a failure, you know, from a marketing perspective, but it was a good, um, you know, we were trying innovation. And I think I would just say, you're not gonna advance if you don't innovate. And so we were trying to innovate and it just didn't work out.